Okay, so this is the PSP screen and settings that you go to. You select connected display settings when you're connected to the HDMI converter that I recommend later on in the video. After selecting connected display settings, you select switch video output, which will put your PSP on your computer screen in the 4K capture utility for Elgato. Okay, so the PSP, you click yes here and you confirm that you want your PSP to be on your computer screen so that you can play your PSP games with your PSP on your PC. Now I'll go over everything. So in this video, I will show you how to connect your PSP to your PC so that you can use your PSP as a controller on your PC monitor and play your games on your PC and also stream. So essentially I have two versions of the PSP here. This is the version that works and I'll show you the specific place. So you need this thing located here so you can plug it in. I'll show out the cables later. And then the original PSP doesn't work because it has this plastic thing in the way so you can't plug it in. Uh, so I'll go into more specifics but basically the PSP 3000s work and I'll show you the exact models that work. Okay, so I have the Final Fantasy Dissidia 20th Anniversary and also the PSP 3000s work. And also, as a side note, the PSP 3000 works with the PS3 USB cable to put PS1 games from the PS3 on it. Okay, so here is the HDMI converter from the PSP. You plug the right-hand side into the back of the PSP like I showed you, and the left-hand side into the Elgato, where I show you now. And you can play PSP games now. Okay, so this picture here is of my Elgato HD60S. They also have a 4K version. Uh, so essentially, you can see the HDMI converter is plugged in right here. And then the smaller cable to its right is the USB 3.0. And that is also plugged into the, on the side that says in on the Elgato HD60S. So nothing is plugged in on the side that says out. Uh, so essentially, the HDMI gets plugged into this side of the Elgato HD60S. And it also gets plugged into the console where you normally plug in the red, white, and yellow cables. And then that USB 3.0 is plugged in here. It's included with the Elgato HD60S. And it's also plugged into your PC tower. This is the Elgato website. Um, basically here you, at this link at the top, you select whichever product at the bottom that you purchased, uh, whichever hardware you purchased for the Elgato. I have the HD60S personally but they have a 4K one now too. And you select whatever you have, like Windows or whatever. And then essentially what you're gonna do is scroll down to the bottom and you select download the 4K capture utility. And essentially um, what you're gonna do is open that up. And uh, once you plug in your console into the inside of the Elgato cable, and you also plug in the Elgato into your PC tower, then uh, you turn on the console and open up your 4K capture utility and your game will be right there just like you could see on my streams on Wall Street Bets on Twitch. So thank you for watching my video. I hope that was helpful. And lastly, here is a heavy duty outlet in case you have a powerful PC. I recommend using this because it's safer and more energy efficient.